And for next cycle, the stock to flow model um, expects or predicts 532k. So the core of the stock to flow model is that more scarcity leads to more value. And thus the halvings are key. Uh, in fact, all the action is around the halvings if you look at uh, the Bitcoin price data. And the, the trading rule is based on exactly that insight. Buy just before the halving, in fact, buy six months before the halving and sell after the halving, in fact, buy six months before and sell 18 months after the halving. Now, look, let, let, let's look at the chart and then we can see uh, what's actually going on. So the strategy is 4x, uh, the, the Bitcoin price. And we're awaiting the next buy signal and we know already that the halving will be around April 2024 so six months before that is um, well around October the closing price of October or the opening price of November then it enters the market and uh, will stay there for two more years until October 2025 24 months later and well very interesting if this cycle will be like all the past cycles, the three past cycles, I should say, it's not that many. Um, and uh, if we see a jump again, and if, 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 well, the Bitcoin scarcity indeed drives the value and thus the whole things uh, are very important and, and, and price jumps are. Plan B, the mastermind behind the renowned stock to flow Bitcoin valuation model, has unveiled a remarkably effective trading strategy that outperforms Bitcoin by a staggering 4x. The brilliance of this approach lies in its simplicity, bordering on the absurd yet undeniably genius. Known as the stock-to-flow trading rule, it comprises two straightforward steps. First, enter the Bitcoin market and make your purchase six months before a Bitcoin halving event, a historically ideal entry point. Then, hold your Bitcoin position for 18 months post-halving before selling. This strategy allows you to bypass crypto bear markets while still reaping substantial gains. Following this strategy to date would have resulted in a remarkable 4x outperformance over Bitcoin itself. In the accompanying video, Plan B meticulously dissects this trading rule and assesses its future prospects. Stick around until the video's end, where Plan B presents two charts suggesting that not only are we in an early bull market but that it's on the verge of accelerating. Basically, a trading rule is a buy and sell action, a simulation of how an um, investment would go over time depending on the buy and sell rules that you give it. So how would the hypothetical equity nine look like? And remember, stock to flow model is a prediction and it predicted in this cycle, uh, 55K, which we are a little below right now. We're at uh, 31K on average in this cycle. So that's below the 55K, which, which is okay. I mean, it, it, stock to flow is not 100% correct. It can be, um, a little bit below or, uh, or above. And for next cycle, the stock to flow model um, expects or predicts 532K. So the core of the stock to flow model is that more scarcity leads to more value. And thus the halvings are key. Uh, in fact, all the action is around the halvings if you look at uh, the Bitcoin price data. And the, the trading rule is based on exactly that insight buy just before the halving in fact buy six months before the halving and sell after the halving in fact buy six months before and sell 18 months after the halving now look let, let's, let's look at the chart and then we can see uh, what's actually going on um, so we see on the x-axis the uh, not the time but the blocks which is essentially time but it it, it gives you the the halvings uh, very neatly so every halving is at, at 210,000 blocks so this was the first halving in November 2012 uh, this is the second halving in um, 2016 I think it was July and the uh, last halving was in May 2020 um, on the x-axis on the y-axis we see the price the Bitcoin price in dollars and the blue line of course is the Bitcoin price it's currently at uh, around 30k and the purple line is the trading rule it's the equity line that starts at five dollars which is around the price of the uh, six months before the, the halving time frame so okay it started at six 
then six months uh, or, or at five dollars six months before the halving it enters the market it buys and then it follows the bitcoin price that's what you see here then we go through the halving then 18 months after the halving it sells and so the value of at, at around that time which was around 600 will stay for as long as the strategy stays out of the market bitcoin of course went into a bear market which the model avoided and then six months before the 2016 halving it entered the market again it bought and then followed the bitcoin price again all the way up to 16,000 and bitcoin price was 10,000 at the time but of course we were starting at a higher price here so we were at 16,000 the strategy and then it sold again 18 months after the halving 18 months after this line and it avoided the complete 20 uh 18 2019 bear market and then six months before the 2020 halving it bought again it entered the market followed the the blue uh, bitcoin line and 18 months after the halving it sold at 122,000. and that's where it's right now bitcoin of course at 30,000. so the strategy is 4x uh, the, the bitcoin price we're awaiting the next buy signal and we know already that the halving will be around april 2024 so six months before that is um well around october the closing price of october or the opening price of november then it enters the market and uh, will stay there for two more years until october 2025 24 months later and well very interesting if this cycle will be like all the past cycles the three past cycles i should say it's not that many um and uh if we see a jump again and if if, if, if well the bitcoin scarcity indeed drives the value and thus the halvings uh, are very important and, and, and price jumps are around the halving again so that was the the trading rule next chart is market stages a lot of questions about this chart as well um, and this is a chart that's not a prediction it's a um, it's a detection so uh, I, I can I cannot it, it, it cannot tell you how long this stage will will last or it, it can only tell you what stage we are in right now and currently we are still in an early bull market the blue stage one early bull market and we're there since uh january so six months already and um we don't know when the when the green starts but usually it's right after the halving uh so here we had the 2020 halving and after that the, the late bull market started the real jump up same here 2016 july was the the halving and then a few months after that the green same here november 2012 was the halving and then the green started right after it so we don't know what's going to happen uh, this time around um the halving might be front run uh, the green could start before the halving and it could also be delayed because of a black swan event or, or something we don't know but uh, well, at least we know when we get there. And uh, once we get in, in, into the, the green area, I will of course let you know. Um, and uh, well, one, one more thing, this market stage model gave me the uh, courage in uh, January 12th to make my market prediction. And if you don't know what it was, it was uh, that the November 15K was the bottom um and and i knew because because the the bull market already started right and uh and after that i said well the halving will be uh, will be around 32k at least so it could be much higher but at least 32k and that prediction was made in january when i knew that we already entered the uh, early early bull market or at least this model indicated that we did that so 
The third and last chart is Realize Price. It's a classic chart by now, but I like it very much. Um, we are so Realize Price is the cost price of all the bitcoins that were uh, that were bought. The black line is the the cost price of all the bitcoins. The dark blue line is the cost price of all the bitcoins that transacted last two years. So it's kind of a moving average, but. The, the advantage of that is that you do not carry uh, the 1 million Satoshi coins all the way through uh, through history and you just uh, look at the more recent coins. So obviously it's a little higher the average cost price than uh, if you include the early year coins. But, uh, but it, it also has this very stable pattern. And uh, well, the important thing what we see is that the Bitcoin price, the red dots, moved um, over, crossed over the two-year realized uh, cost price. And it already crossed uh, the realized cost price. It already crossed the five months, the short-term uh, realized and hotter price. So now, um, and, and that's a new thing, I haven't even tweeted about it, it crossed the two-year realized uh, price. And that's an important signal. Of course, the month... Of in 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 uh, in history closing above the two-year realized price was a um, a signal that the bull market accelerated uh, same here in 2016 and 2019 was a bit of a weird year with a covid um, black swan here and well i might have some influence uh, had some influence here with the stock to flow model that was maybe front run but we were a bit er market was a bit early here um, but if we if we take this and this dots as as uh, crossing the, the two you realize this is also where the the bull market started so it's very interesting and well one more thing is also very interesting um, the realized price the black line and the two-year realized price the dark blue line started to increase again since a long time I see something I think it, it declined for about a year and now for the first month it's increasing again and that's when things become really interesting so we'll have to see what the Bitcoin will do uh, if we cross 32 uh, fast then uh, I might have to update my January 12 prediction that the halving will be um, at 32 32,000 or above which is of course uh, based on this two-year realized uh, price but if we already cross that and we already we, we still have eight months to go so uh, then probably we will end up uh, a lot higher um, so i will probably do an update the celebrated on-chain analyst plan b delves into his groundbreaking doctor flow trading rule this rule represents a remarkable fusion of simplicity and genius offering a fresh perspective on bitcoin's trajectory the charts presented towards the video's conclusion are truly mind-boggling, provoking contemplation about Bitcoin's potential future path. However, a word of caution for those considering replicating the stock-to-flow trading rule, past performance does not guarantee future results. Historical success doesn't necessarily translate into continued effectiveness. Furthermore, if this strategy becomes widely known, investors may attempt to front-run it, potentially altering the market dynamics significantly. For more Daily Dose crypto news, check out these two awesome videos on your screen. Click now and we will see you on the next video.